Per contract, uh, where we were paying 17,987 uh, for the double cabs, as you can see them, there are 20 of them, and then we have a, a Prado, a Prado v, uh, VLX at 41,000. So that, was, that is per day. So if you can multiply that by 365, and then by five years, you will know the total contract amount. So we are stating that the reason for uh, stopping this contract is not because uh, we, 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 we feel that, we just feel that there, there, there are some opaque arrangements around it. We as a county are committed to settling all our other contracts, but this particular one had uh, uh, other third party like kind of arrangements which we feel uh, were not were not it was not a transparent contract that is to state Be, uh, because of the leasing we are not because of uh, leasing of these executive vehicles we are not able to undertake a lot of uh, uh, core core aspects of the county that is some of these vehicles were taken without a valid and a serious needs assessment because where really would you use the 20 vehicles that we have actually we don't need them so uh, we are not able to provide for 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 our health we are not able to provide for such like activities because we have vehicles here we found ourselves with vehicles that uh, all along we thought that we were dealing with the person who was given the contract to supply us with motor vehicles for leasing purposes. But uh, later on we found ourselves with uh, vehicles belonging to third parties and uh, after some uh, perusal of the documents we found some very opaque uh, uh, agreements that we felt like a government it was not appropriate for us to continue with the arrangement. So.